Welcome to JC Aerial Studio 101. In this tutorial, we're going to talk about from how to review and trim the footage and use the software called Filmora to edit our video to create a short cinematic footage. I wish you enjoyed the tutorial and please like and subscribe my channel for more upcoming tutorials. First, let's review one of the videos that I shot with my drone for one of my projects that I worked on. And on this video, I was trying to chase the horses from the back. And I was really glad that they behaved so well even though my drone was really loud. The first point that I would like to emphasize is reviewing the entire footage. I strongly recommend you to review your footage at least two to three times or even more until you find the most steady clips for your cinematic footage. When you found the most steady clip, Mark the beginning and the end time of the clip for future trimming. And for example, I'm going to choose from 14 seconds to 18 seconds. This practice will help you to trim the clip easier than trying to remember the best moment. It also helps removing unnecessary so-called best movement hunting effort that you put on while reviewing your footage. And now let's talk about trimming. After thoroughly reviewing your entire footage and marked several duration of your footage, individually save them on a folder and give them a short name for your reference. And I will show you the details shortly. Here on Windows 10, you can go to Edit and Create, tap on the right top side, and click Trim option. And now you can move the cursor to the beginning of the clip and the end of the clip. Here on this video, I'll choose from 14 seconds to 18 seconds. But I would like to emphasize the importance of reviewing your one second range of beginning and end point of your clip. As you can see, there are several movements, but notice that they are within one second range, which is 14 seconds. So even though these different movements are showing here on the footage, they are all within one second range. With a blink of an eye, there might be a slight distraction that will ruin the footage. Meaning you want to make sure the clip starts and ends naturally with smooth movement. And now, review the clip by pressing play button. And simply save a copy to your desktop and give it a good name. And now you're done. Now after thoroughly reviewing my videos, marking the durations, trimming and saving them as short clips, I collected them into one folder called Cuts. On the next tutorial video here on JC Aerial Studio 101, I'm going to show you how to use a editing program called Wondershare Filmora to compile short clips that we collected into one cinematic footage. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel for upcoming tutorial.
Thank you.